Hey everybody, this is Eddie, and I just want to show you a quick new tool that I've just found out about uh, that I think will be very helpful to you. Have you ever signed up for a newsletter or went onto a website that forced you to put in your email address before they'd let you in to see their content? Well, a lot of times what these sites are doing is they're taking your personal email address and then they're selling them uh, to advertisers who are going to try to spam your inbox. So to protect yourself, you can use uh, a service like this one. This is called Yopmail, Y-O-P-M-A-I-L. And Yopmail, when you go to sign up for it, there's no registration. Okay, so you don't have to put in any kind of password. Um, it's an auto-generated inbox and messages are only kept for eight days. So it's a great way to, to use a legitimate email address that won't come to your inbox and you can if there's something like if you register for uh, maybe a, uh, some software or something and you don't want the developer to continue to email you you can just make up a yacht mail email address and you can do that on the developer's website then come to yacht mail and put in that that email address so what i did a little bit earlier on earlier tonight is i sent an email to a yacht mail account and the name of that yacht mail account was rocketman44 and so i just went to uh rock uh, to the email typed in rocketman44 at yachtmail.com it's y-o-p-m-a-i-l.com and went ahead and sent that test email so i'm gonna go ahead and click check inbox you notice i'm not going to be putting in any kind of password or anything like that it's not asking me for any of my personal information so i'm going to get click on check inbox and there is that test email I sent earlier tonight. And um, that's pretty cool. And there's not a whole lot to Yacht Mail. It's just a way to check your your mail. You can you can forward that email on to something someone else using Yacht Mail if you want to. Um, and there's some uh, other types of information that you can get here, like you can view HTML, text only, and you can view the headers, and you can print from here. So it is quite useful and then um, when you're done with a piece of mail then you can click on the little red x here and delete that anyway just want to tell you about that cool that, that cool little feature um you can create literally thousands of email addresses that you don't have to even worry about if you're never going to check them that's fine for a lot of newsletters and blogs and things i might sign up for i'm going to start using this that way i don't get slammed with a lot of emails from people i don't really want to hear from anyway usually they're advertisers. So hope you enjoyed this video. I hope it helps you out and have a good night.